Hi everybody, Andy here with eTrailer.com and today we're going to take a look at this two-point cam action lockable door latch for large enclosed trailers. This cam action door latch is ideal for heavy duty side or rear doors on large trailers and it pairs with a three-quarter of an inch diameter pipe that is not included with this. The bridge type hasp is going to help prevent accidental opening and it ensures safe latching action. And this can be locked with a padlock, which is sold separately. Two anti-rack keepers and long lug wraps tightly around the pipe to help prevent latch doors from jumping and shifting. And the bolt holes on the pipe retainers are on one side so you can mount the pipe closer to the edge of your door. The double action handle assembly is going to ensure simple and secure latching and it helps protect against in transit jarring. Just flip the handle uh, keeper on the hasp up as I just did here and lift the handle and then just rotate um, the handle to either release or engage the cams and the um, handle length is a little over 14 inches let me go ahead and pull out my tape measure here just to confirm that so it's looking like it is sitting right at about 14 inches long on that handle length and if you've already noticed here it does have this black vinyl handle that provides a smooth and comfortable grip so this is going to be a simple bolt-on installation, but I do want to point out that this does not include any mounting hardware. So that is something that you would have to pick up separately. This, uh, this does require a schedule uh, 40, uh, 43 quarter inch plumber's pipe. That needs to be welded to the cam ends as well as the handle for complete installation. The non-removable pins are going to ensure maximum security to keep your cargo safe, helping to prevent the tampering and removal of your door. The reversible design is going to allow the latch to be used on the left hand or right hand doors. And this is made in the USA of stainless steel construction, so it is rust proof and corrosion resistant. I do want to uh, leave you with a few measurements here. Looking at that hasp, the overall um, height of the hasp itself. Lining this up here as best as I can. It looks like we're sitting right at about five and one eighth inches, inches tall. And then the overall width, we are sitting right at two inches wide. And then I measured earlier the distance between the mounting holes center to center. That's sitting right at three and three quarters inches. Now for a listing of the measurements of the other pieces of this kit, visit this product page here at eTrailer.com under the specs section, and there's going to be other smaller, more detailed measurements of the other pieces of this kit, and that's going to help you determine if this is going to work for your particular application. Well, that's going to conclude our look today. I do hope that it was helpful for you. Again, my name is Andy. Thank you for joining me.